But what is up, guys? Welcome in. My name is Nick, and welcome to the channel. And uh, we're mixing up a little bit this time. We're going to do a bit of racing in the GT86. It's at Oschersleben, I think you call it. Uh, apologies for anyone on the continent who I slaughtered that for. Um, yeah, uh, it's one of my favourite tracks, one of my favourite cars, and uh, yeah, it's more importantly part of the free combination this week. So I thought I'd give it a go. But before we do, I must make sure I thank all of my channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Uh, if you would like to help out, press the button down below. And um, if you do enjoy this video, do remember to leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe for plenty more videos in the future. So let's get to it. Right, guys, you join me on the grid. Well, I, I think this is a rolling start, in fact, actually, in the uh, GT86 here at Oschersleben. Apologies for slaughtering that um yeah felt like a bit of a change go rear wheel drive and this was on a free track and it's a free car so i thought i'd give it a go i've done a bit of practice in um i didn't qualify for this one because i think it's a rolling start i've not done one before i was just gonna go with the flow with that one but yeah we're basically just gonna have a look and see how we get on with this one um i one of my favorite tracks um i rarely ever come across it in most other simulators so when i saw this as a free track gt86 is also one of my favorite cars as well in terms of real world so yeah it seemed to work well for me so hopefully this will go well i've been doing mid 40s in practice so that should put me at the front mid field i think based on qualifying times but who knows i don't know anything about these G these gt lobbies they could be full of carnage we don't know we'll wait for the last people to load in and hopefully we'll get a good race okay so nearing the end of our rolling start lap Stay behind this yellow and blue car in front. No idea on the start procedure. Go, go, go. Okay, yep, sure. Okay, Nick. 15 minutes left. That's 15 minutes. I'll go on my left. I'm not going to fight him coming to this left hander because it's difficult enough. Looks like there's been relatively low amounts of murder. Guy in front is lagging though, so that is regret regrettable he's in front now. Just going to spend a little while warming the car up. Why are you braking? This is a flat out that bit. I'm a bit worried this guy, well, I mean, he's weaving for a start. He's also jumping about a little bit. Oh, tried to cut back there, but he braked mid corner for some reason. Hold your line. Clear left. Oh, this guy's in front, it's so slow. Well, please don't. Oh, someone got caught out a little bit there. Contact. I need to find a way past these guys. Not confident enough yet. This is pretty much single file. I'm having a break because people in front of me are breaking. Don't know where he's going. Like this. Still there. Still there. Clear left. Oh, how the hell we made it through there? I have no idea. Fair play to that guy. Clear left. The leader has just done a 139.0.
Alright, we might be able to send it coming into the, the first bit here. B13, right side. Hold your line. Clear right. Didn't quite have the confidence to send it. We are getting dropped by the guys ahead though. Leader's got to pick up the pace a little bit. Come on Alex, hurry up. I don't really want to fight him, but I need him to get quicker. I do feel like I'm being held up at this moment. I know the guy behind me definitely feels the same. Not just not gonna be close enough. Oh, totally missed my turning point there. Ten minutes remaining. Ten minutes. Okay, Nick. Double chances here. Let's make sure we can take them. Incident in Saxon and Hull curve. Looks like it's Shields. Yellow flag. Oh, we got someone off. Okay. To be fair, Alex has picked up the uh, picked up the pace a bit. B12, fastest lap. Sector one is 0.3 seconds off the pace. Should have gone out wider there. Could have carried a bit more speed. Had to lift off through a second part. Difficult to find a passing place in this track. Oh, I'm wide a bit there. Can make me very slow down this straight here now. That was better. We might have the run now. Ah, not quite. Come on, man, I need you to speed up a bit. Go wide, I might make him slow. Oh, you are not giving me a lot of space. Good racing though, good racing by this guy. Oh, he got a bit sideways on the exit. I don't think I'm gonna have enough though. We are very evenly matched on pace. We do have a run, but I don't think it's gonna be enough. On your right. Hold your right side's clear. Oh, there we go, we forced him into a mistake. We'll take that, we'll take that. Right, now I need to book it. Uh, it's a bit offline coming through there. It's going to make me slow again down this straight. Okay, Nick. Five minutes to uh, Five minutes left. Too quick okay. into that second corner there. Got on that sausage curve, just meant I couldn't get on the throttle when I wanted to. Oh, 
definitely need to be more aggressive through that first part of that corner. I'm right on the exit from the guy behind me. Should I shift down there? Don't know, it feels a little bit sluggish in third, but a little bit over every in second. I didn't like that. That was much better, much, much better. There we go, we're starting to gap the guy behind me now. In a little bit of a no man's land right now. P10, uh, top 10 would be nice. That felt quicker through there. Can't see my delta where I've got the camera set at the moment. Uh, I definitely feel more comfortable in second. I don't think P10 is going to happen unless these two start squabbling. Why have the wipers turned on? Don't know what happened there. Kind of threw me off for a second part of that corner, I'm not going to lie. Oh, I hit the sausage curb on the entry, that threw me off line. Why did I break? I don't need to break there. Oh, there we go. There we go. Nose boiled there. Penultimate lap. Final lap, and we've now snuck inside top 10. Alright, now don't be an idiot. So don't be an idiot. Bouncy on entry there. Stop breaking on entry, you fool. The uh, guy behind me was on a mission at the end there, but we managed to keep him behind us. Oh. P9. Happy with that? Very, very happy with that. That was that was very good. Some good racing with Alex there, early on. Just going to make sure we keep out of everyone's way. But yeah, that was that was awesome. That was an awesome race. Good fights everywhere. I didn't mess up, which was. Uh, big part of that get past people we needed to when did Alex come home P16 uh, that's a shame for him I was having a good good fight I was just alongside him enough to throw him off his line which I've been pressuring him for a while I think he's finally just cracked but yeah just gonna do these calm down laps here hoover up a little bit extra safety rating even though that we have managed to get through that whole race I believe with no X's in there so good safety rating haul hopefully we'll get a bit of uh, I rating as well we dropped a little bit um, I probably mentioned in the intro um, I did an MX5 race that dropped a smidge we're still around still 13 mid 13k uh, 1.3 13k Jesus 1.3k um, yeah I'll stop waffling now so I can jump to the scoreboard and um, yeah, and we'll, I think we'll do maybe one more of these because this was a lot of fun. A lot, a lot of fun. Right, guys. So after that one, we have a slight improvement to our safety rating up to 3.7. 
and our I rating is about where it was before, a little bit lower, I think, uh, 1363. Um, so yeah, that was a good race. Uh, not much to gain in that because we were in about the right lobby that we should have been, and we finished in about the right place we should have finished. We were car number 12, and we finished in P9. So speaking of which... So if we look here, um, we were about a second of the lap off the lead pace. Uh, fastest was a 138.8, so that was a full 1.1 second quicker than me around that circuit. So, yeah, we've got a bit more time to find there. I think a lot of it will come from more uh, commitment in the car, um, just knowing more, but I'm not running the GTA 6 series this, this, uh, this season. So that's unlikely for me to know all the bits about this car, really. I mean, this is, again, we're in split number three. We're nowhere near top split speed either. But around my uh, I rating, uh, well, you say up to about 1,500, actually, the, uh, the the league guys are here. So, yeah, um, a lot of pace for me to find in it, but I'm happy with how that went. I didn't bin it. That's always a good day. 139.9 is my quickest. I've not been able to break the 34, uh, 140s in practice. So, in the once again, in the actual heat of the moment, I can find myself pulling out the best best times when I've actually got, you know, a carrot to chase. But yeah, I've done enough waffling for this race. Let's go and jump into the next one. So slight change of plan. I'm doing this um, at on Monday evening, which is basically when the servers reset. And it is three minutes away from being a 1 a.m. UK time, which will mean uh, it is about to flip over to next week's rotation. So unfortunately, there's just one race in the GTA 6. Apologies for that. It's been a very busy week. For me, I've not been able to get on here as much. I was hoping to get the MX-5s in as well. Um, but yeah, I didn't think that they swapped over until like mid whenever the patches normally drop for um, the, like, the ones that are coming on like midday on Tuesday here, UK time. And I thought that's when the races switched over. So yeah, that is my mistake. Um, but thank you very much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy this one, drop me a like, leave me a comment. And um, if you want to see more, do please subscribe. I mostly do touring cars for this season, but I will be expanding out to do some other stuff as I go through my iRacing journey. It'd be great if you could come along with me. If you enjoyed this one, why not have a look on the one on screen now? I'll do the YouTuber thing of point in one direction or the other because I always forget what side it is. And uh, yeah, I will catch you in the next one. Cheers.